Hello, and welcome back, wonderful, amazing video game time people, to this war of mine. Hmm. So, I've been uh, worrying a lot about fighting in this game, and unfortunately, there's no real good way to practice fighting. Uh, I was trying to figure out how to save scum, but I uh, haven't quite done it yet. Someone tried to rob us. There were just a couple of scavengers, so we ma shall we manage to fend them off? We had some weapons, but not enough for everyone. Cool. Alright, what was it that we needed to get done here? Right. Get to bed. I'm glad I caught you up with people in the grass. Slightly sick, recovering, hungry. Alright, well. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna start by having you cook for everybody. What's the other things? Um... Yeah, I don't think we have enough mats. Hopefully the trader guy comes. A thing I have learned by reading online type things is that I need to get an axe. Oh, don't be that guy. Ugh. Make a filter, make a filter. Alrighty. And go ahead. Back to bed. I used to be an optimist, one of those people who'd have sworn that war wouldn't come. War has happened far away, in third world countries, or so I thought. Even when I was listening to the news, getting scarier day by day, I did not believe all that was about to happen. Oh. Used to be an optimist, eh? Oh, Bruno. That was a good trade. We helped each other out. Cool. Huh. I have some stuff in exchange. Let's go, Katya. Sorry to bother your sleep. Oh, you're sleeping in your backpack. That doesn't look comfortable. Let's see what we can change. Let's make a deal. Alright. Show me what you want to trade. Can you bring anything good? I will happily take all of that. What do you want in exchange, bud? I don't want it that much. Um, I'm keeping the knife. Uh, fine, we can have a deal, really. Another thing of medication. Ugh. Seems unreasonable, but okay. I think I think that'll do. I'm interested in some extra tobacco. Um, lots of materials for some meds. Oh, seems like a bit of a ripoff, but okay, let's do it.
Let's see if you can upgrade. Oof. Okay, more wood and two more of those things. Done. Two more parts and some wood. We should be able to get that. Tell me he has it. Yeah. Alright, what are you asking for now, buddy old pal? Okay. That seems awful, but okay. Deal. I don't think we need anything more. Bye. Get back to bed. Get to work, buddy. Wow, he's a fast runner. Yep. Go ahead. Nice. Let's take a look what that's done for us. Helmet. She's gonna require a damaged helmet, cool. Shotgun. Damaged shotgun, damaged handgun. Because any damaged guns I can now repair. But what I want is that hatchet. Which means we're gonna need weapon parts. Huh. Five weapon parts. Pretty cool. Let's see what's on the radio. Beware of bands of looters roaming the city. It's best to lock your doors and stay inside. That's no good. Alright, it's cool outside, possible rainfall. Classical music. Cool. Let's make it happen. Well, everyone's doing okay. They're content. So that's got to be good. Maybe I should send this guy away from now on.
Content tired, content hungry. Slightly sick and content. There'll be no fighting, I suppose, but I don't suppose I was expecting it. We want to hit up that discrepant squat with my good friend here, Pavle, sleep in bed. God. Yeah, Kaj gets to eat tomorrow. <laughs> Probably gonna have to sleep off tomorrow as well. Good lord. Uh. Okay. I really just wanna saw through that thing and see how that goes. Uh, should be fine. I don't think we need the knife. Mostly looking for weapons parts, if I remember. I wonder if that homeless fellow is still here. Probably. And this music, man. Talk about scary. Let's start cutting. Oh jeez, there's a guy downstairs. That's terrifying. Grab it all. Clicking works nice. I think that's just the homeless guy. I don't think he's a threat at all. Besides, I, I gave him food last time, but if he sees me, he'll probably ask for more. Bit of a bummer about up there. Moonshine. Apparently, we want electronics too. Uh, you know what? I don't know. Parts. Apparently, once we get that axe, we're not going to worry so much about the other thing. That's more what we're looking for. Uh, I 
Thank you once again. Yeah, you're welcome, buddy, old pal. Hey, wait a minute. There we go. What do we what do we find? Okay. Get rid of the moonshine. Drop the cigars. And let's start getting some of the good stuff here. Books. Okay. Shell casings. Ah. Alright, take the few cigarettes for now. Actually, I'm pretty sure I've already looked through that. Huh. What happens if I break through here? I think I've already looked through this stuff, haven't I? Where are all these supposed weapons? There's supposed to be weapons everywhere, but there are no weapons anywhere. Okay, well, we'll take the materials for now. And hope for the best, I suppose. Though some trading goods would be nice if he ends up having some weapons parts. Bit of a bummer, this, really. Maybe jump up. Hey. Nope, nothing. Alright. Guess we'll go with it. Seems reasonable somehow. I don't think we necessarily need the uh, tobacco. This stuff's probably more handy. Hmm, that was a disappointing one. Nothing for weapons, eh? Or food, for that matter. Hmm. Nice. The night was calm. That's pleasant. Very tired. So here's what we're gonna do. You're gonna just... I wish I could help Kachas. He looks so hungry. Very hungry. Uh. Everybody looks kind of hungry right now. Oh. Uh, that lack of weapons parts, though. Yeah, leave it on the classical music. Thanks. Anything useful we can make? Probably ought to make a filter. Um, another bed? Oh, another bed sounds kind of nice, actually. I'm gonna just have him sleep during the day. Herbal workshop. Also sounds lovely. Hmm. I still no. Uh, trap for small animals. Herbal garden. <laughs> I 
Alright. This whole very hungry affair just won't do. So... Bruno, get your butt over there. Start cooking. Or at least take a look at it. While Kachi gets some rest. Hmm. Need a little bit more water and a little bit more fuel. Alright, got you get to bed. Bruno can wait on the food. I've got a nasty headache, have you? Huh. I don't think we need the advanced workshop. But I certainly would not mind making that third bed. So let's do it. Um, that really doesn't seem that bad, does it? if I trust this guy. Does he want to join us? Who is this? Hi. My name is Marine. I can repair. Uh, I ran a repair workshop, but it was, was burned down. I have nothing to go back to. Maybe I could stay here with you. I'm handy with all kinds of tools. If you have some junk lying around, I could use it to make this place more habitable. Oh, oh Marine. But it was burned down. I have nothing to go back to. Maybe I could stay here with you. Uh, I don't know, man. We've got a good thing going here. All right, come on. Do I just tell me what to do? Okay. Marine the handyman. For starters, you can build that bed. Anything else useful, Marine? Probably not, hey. Yeah, that's what I thought. See, for Marine, it takes less components to make things. So that's actually not that bad at all. He could actually make a moonshine still. Which sounds quite nice. Let's make a moonshine still, because we're pretty good at trading. Right there. Alright, let's get cooking, buddy. <laughs> I don't trust anyone. I don't. water and fuel. He 
use the last two to make fuel. Hopefully she'll just... Oh no, she's still hungry. Yikes. I don't want anybody to be hungry. Least of all Katya. Get to know the new guy. Alright, we're running out of water. So that's no good. And we're out of food. Uh, we're just gonna need more, way more water. So we might want to manufacture some of those things. A couple filters. Yeah. Meanwhile, everyone just hang out. <sighs> Marino also drinks coffee. Pavle, fast runner, bargaining skills, slightly sick. Uh, yeah, and it's not like we have any medicine left. I'm not quite sure where to go, really. Um, Kancha might be great for this. Um, I think I'll send Kancha out today. Because we do need food. Um, Bruno can sleep in bed. One of these guys has to guard. Two people can sleep in bed, okay. Uh, Katja. St. Mary's. Still a place of meetings for the local community. Priest Olek is known for his charitable work and offering refuge to the poor. He might have something to give or away or trade. The vestry behind the church is devastated and abandoned. We could find some useful materials in there. I want food! The semi-detached house. Half of it is a ruin, but there are people living in the other half. They don't seem friendly. At night, you can sometimes hear shots fired from there. We could probably scour the abandoned part for supplies if we manage to sneak past the inhabited part. I don't know. Doesn't sound like there's much for trading over there. And there's nothing left there. Uh, what, what is this weapons you speak of? Where are all these weapons? Supermarket. Lots of food. Quiet house. Stealing from folk. Let's try the semi-detached house with Pavle, because he's actually fast. I'll give him a knife, even. This could be risky. This could be where we lose everyone, so that's no good. But, okay. We need that huge amount of food thing. Uh, I can't help feeling that we ought to um, take a knife. It's too bad he's hungry. He really ought not to be if we're gonna potentially try to kill people here, but okay. Uh, I suppose you might as well take some lockpicks. We'll try not to fight. Let's go. Oh god. This is gonna be how Pavla dies. You're about to see Pavla die. I'm not ready for this. Three people. Ooh. Well, 
Ozena will shoot him on sight. Running short on meds. And there's a lot of these folk. Weapons parts. What is that? Damn. Oh shit. I think that guy saw us. He said you're dead. Oh, that was terrifying. I'm tired. I better go back to bed. You right, you better. Why not make some noise and give this whole knife thing a try? Devastatingly hard. Kill the guy in bed. This might be it. Oh my god. Stop. You're killing me. <sighs> Private property, take it. I don't care. Oh my. This is getting stressful. Yes! No! Shit! Pavle, book it! Oh, shit! Damn!
Pick it up, pick it up. Quickly, 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 quickly. Get the gun, get the gun, get the gun. Hurry, hurry. Alright, we got a shotgun. We're only slightly wounded. We've cut the bandages. Run to the exit. Run to the exit, boy. Holy cow. I think Pavla just killed two people. Did you hear the crying? That was awful. Things just got really dark. He doesn't seem very happy. Meanwhile, someone raided us. Oh. Everyone's slightly wounded. And Pablo is sad. Oh no. <laughs> He's sad. Oh good. We're all sad and hungry. Love it. Slightly sick. And hungry. I think we've doomed us all. I think we've doomed us all. <laughs> Vegetables will do us no good. No good. I just wanted to kill someone. No. No. Food. There you go. We're getting there. Well, I'm bleeding, but just a little. Go bang a bandage on it, buddy, old pal. Go listen to the radio and go get some sleep. Oh, Pavle, why did you have to do this? Yeah, I suppose you really shouldn't have. Wow. Oh, he feels fine. Cool. We're no better than the military, using force to get what they want. Pavle murdered someone last night. What have we become? Oh, no. God, should take some herbal meds. Bandaged, recovering, sad, tired. It'll be fine, I'll get over it. Can't we manage without hurting others? Probably not, Bruno. What are your thoughts? Reality is cruel. If we are to survive, we have to be equally cruel. I'd rather probably killed than if he got killed. We need him. Good, good. I like Bruno. Bruno's reasonable. Bruno don't give a shit. <laughs> Alright, this is turning out to be a really long video. That's okay. Let's let this day take its... Horse, I suppose, hey? How much to be done? Suppose I could make water. Not a lot of good that'll do us. Yeah, we don't have any water. Get us some water, son. But they sometimes shot at people. It was just another group of survivors is what it was, isn't it? Just another old group of survivors.
Well, we killed two people. Because, you know, we're like the walking dead. We don't take crap from nobody. Nobody, sir. It's kind of a depressing day. Even the music is depressing. Alright. We'll need some booze for Pavle, probably. Maybe a little bit of moonshine. What is Pavle? Nothing. He's just a fast runner. The guy threatened to shoot us, man. It was terrifying. Man, I don't know. I feel guilty about the whole thing. We gotta do something good. Won't do with everybody being hungry and all. No food. No canned food. We're all gonna starve. Can't decide who to send out. Go sleep with Pavle. Go sleep with him. <laughs> oh, okay. Sad, sad. Hungry, slightly sick. Alright, I say we send Bruno to the supermarket. Um... Everybody else is pretty much sick. Yeah, she needs to sleep it off. I think Marin could do that, but Bruno needs to start getting us some food. A small yet luxurious hotel previously owned by Pogrom Travel Agency, presently occupied by some armed thugs. Screams are sometimes heard coming from the building. It's best to keep away from it. The store supplied the whole neighborhood before the latter turned into a war zone. Since the area is under military control, it might be dangerous to do the groceries there. Still, it might be worth the risk, as there should be a lot of goods left. I really, I'm just looking for some food. <laughs> like, please. Small apartment building. Ooh. Well-armed individuals taking refuge there. Shelled school. Oh. Possible trade. Rebel militiamen moved into the abandoned building. It might be willing to help us. City Hospital. Oh, there's a renowned doctor who still remains. Well, that's good. Okay, let's try the supermarket. And I'm aware that it's dangerous. I go. We're gonna take a shotgun and a knife and other lovely things. And then the rest we're gonna use to get food. That's a lot of items for somebody who doesn't have a lot of space. All right, we're looking for food. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Man, this place is seedy. What's going on over there? That's a pretty name for such a pretty face. Thank you. Looking for something? Just some food. Well, hold on now. I need some food too. Food. Poor girl. I can give you food for a favor. Wait, what? Just come with me, babe. We'll dine and have some fun. No. 
No, I'm afraid I can't. Is this soldier? This is a soldier about to rape a girl. The hell you can't. Whoa, whoa, whoa. If you don't want to starve, you have to do what I tell you. Switch the shotgun. Nice. Did we hit her? I hope we didn't. But I'm I'm helping you. Really? What can I do? I'm But I I'm confused. I think I just saved her life. Maybe I didn't, I don't know. We'll see what the bio says when we get back in the morning. Meantime, food. We don't have time for heroics anymore. That was fun. Knifed him in the back of the head and then shot him with a shotgun. Yeah, yeah, that's how we do. Did I take an AK or something? I feel like I did. Come on. Food. Food. Mm. Let's go, let's go. Shotgun shot to the face. Maybe I accidentally hit the girl and that's why she was running away. I don't know. Food, damn it. What is so hard to understand about that? Oh, you guys are killing me right now. You're not sure how to get there, buddy. Found food. We're going to make it through. You understand. We're going to make it through at any cost. I will kill. I will shoot. But damn it. We need food. you are finding is not enough food, sir. There's, there's just no food, is there? The food is a myth. Oh, for goodness sake. Aha! I'm starting to think maybe I'm scavenging in all the wrong places. Let's go, let's go. Down into the basement. Go, go, go. Damn it. Just find me some food. More weapon parts. Nice. I suppose I could take some water. under the bed. Why is there a bed in a supermarket? 
weird supermarket this. Oh yeah. I think we just hit jackpot. Med ingredients. Woo-wee! Alright, um keep the assault rifle. Because that's awesome. Um, we got a little bit of food. We got an assault rifle. Anything that we don't need, maybe. You know what? Keep the moonshine. Keep the moonshine, damn it. That'll be handy. I think 5 a.m. is time's up. Sun's rising, I gotta move. Yeah, you never get through there. Still. If only you had some kind of shovel. I wonder what happens when the timer reaches five. I think as far as we're concerned, this let's play is ending. Don has caught Bruno. It will be harder to return. What? It will be harder to return? Oh, shoot. Hope he doesn't get shot on his way home. Oh, gosh. The Don has caught Bruno. The night was calm, but we hope Bruno will return. What? Oh, no. Bruno got such a good haul. We need him to get back. No. 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 Bruno, please get back. Hurry, Bruno. I didn't realize. I didn't realize this would happen. Oh, Bruno. I found many interesting things. Oh. I am back and in one piece if a bit tired. Oh, good. Hey, Pablo's happy. Everybody just got happy for some reason. Why is everybody happy? Uh, we need to make sure we have enough food for everybody. I've been around more than any of my friends and rel relatives. I've met famous people. Readers found my interviews funny and incisive, but when I try to write down my experiences, I'm stuck. I want to find and hug my folks, not write about them. I wish I had been seeing them more often. Oh, well, that sucks. Bruno. My hands are still trembling. That soldier could have killed me, but I did the right thing. Good job, Bruno. Yeah. Alright, that brought everybody back. Now, Bruno. Don't waste time. Start cooking, okay? Don't be that guy, Bruno. You're gonna make some wood. Or food, or whatever. Fuel. You're gonna make us some fuel, Bruno. And then you're gonna cook, and then we're all gonna feast. Whew. We're all gonna have an epic feast tonight. Because everybody is hungry. Pablo's very hungry. So. I don't got no time for you. Alright, Kacha, you uh, better. Slightly sick and tired. Go. Maybe. You just go. Was someone knocking? Yes. Have a look at what I brought. Did you bring us food? Oh, mama. You may, might as well have, actually. I've got some nice things for trade, friend. Got some real nice things for trade. Uh, okay. First and foremost, I want food. Let's talk about that. Oh, the fact that... 
I'll give you my drugs, because you seem to love that. And you're going to give me everything I could possibly ever want. Which, uh, hold on. Your decision later. Yeah, yeah, I know I will, I know I will. Uh, Bruno, maybe... Check out, what does it take to make an axe? What do we need? We need wood. That's it. Okay. We'll see if we can get that five wood off the guy. Come on. Five wood. Done. There's your drugs. You fool. Fool of a took. It won't try. I mean, it won't do. Are you? Are you mad? You must be. All right. The food is worth less than canned food, so that's good. Um, I could definitely take some fuel. Um, some fuel, some water, some materials. There's lots of good things here for us. Uh. So don't forget, I have moonshine. Yeah. Yeah, I like the idea of moonshine. So I give you moonshine. You give me the water. And I will happily take a whack ton of materials. Mm hmm Mm-hmm. It won't do. Try harder, you say. Well, darn you. I'll take all of that. You can... Three herbs. That's it, buddy. I want your food. I am very much interested in this. Deal. Yeah. Close the door on. Hungry, slightly wounded, content. Okay. Go eat some canned food. Actually, Bruno might as well just cook another batch. Don't eat the canned food. Still hungry, eh? Let's do it. Let's have a feast. Look at that. Wow. I like that. We don't want to use up all our food supply, but yeah. Let's have a feast, buddy. Marin. If then you wouldn't mind, Mr. Handyman. Make it, please. Oh, it is feast time. Good stuff. Have at her, have at her. That'll do for now. Content. Slightly sick. Hungry. Courage. Yeah, we always knew he did. Oh, there we go. Get at her. Slightly sick, tired, hungry. Go eat, man. Pick that up. What did we get from axing that thing? Woo! Fuel and wood. Love it. Nothing axable in there, eh? Uh, don't axe the bed. Please. But feel free to axe that cupboard. Um... 
I want to be well fed. Slightly wounded, slightly wounded content. Wow, lots of wood. Slightly wounded, slightly wounded, slightly sick. Alright, okay, okay, we're gonna we're gonna end the game here. Cause it's been really long. This is good though. We kind of made a couple blunders, but recovered pretty nicely by by attacking the military guy, and that made everybody feel better. So that's good. Even though Pavle has killed people, he's well fed. So I'm I'm spent, hoping to send him out scavenging because I feel like a well fed Pavle is gonna be better at combat. Not that you know I'm planning for combat, but I mean if I was, that's what I would be doing. So everybody else can uh, this slightly sick, slightly wounded, slightly wounded. Um, Slightly sick and tired. Uh, slightly wounded and content. I think we're going to want Kacha to guard today. And I'm not quite sure where we're going to visit. Um, uh, the semi-detached house apparently has more things. There's no reason we couldn't actually just finish killing them all. But uh, probably wouldn't want to. Um, some shady looking well armed individuals taking refuge here. Decrepit squat. Yeah, nothing there. Garage. Could trade with them, wouldn't want to uh, cause any problems. I feel like the semi detached house would be the place to go. I want to keep going. They apparently have lots of food. I'd be interested in getting some. And maybe in finishing them off a bit. I don't know. They'll probably attack on site. Yeah, okay. Um, okay. That's what's gonna happen. I'll see you guys next time on, uh, on this awesome game. Thanks for watching. Bye.